What is up guys, Jimmins Gaming back again bringing another Call of Duty Black Ops 2 gameplay with story mode. So first off we're going to get started off with the class setup and uh, here we go. Primary weapon AN94 with the afterlife camo, very nice camo like I said in previous videos. If you can buy a bag of chips for $1.99, you can buy this camo, or well recommended is the weaponized 115. But anyways, let's get back to the class setup. Fast mag, flat jacket, hardline, scavenger, toughness, dexterity. With the C4, in today's gameplay, we are going on a 44 gun streak. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Alright guys, anyways, I want to get into story mode. Today's topic, today's story, hitchhiking. Me and my friend are, sorry are traveling out to a camp to meet up with some girls, have a good time, out at their camp. So, uh, we got my car, and uh, apparently my car had uh, a leak um, in the, you know, the, the coolant system, and so we already knew this, but we were eager to get to the girls, the ladies' camp. So, we filled up two, two liters of uh, Pepsi bottles of water because I knew it was leaking and it was a far trip. I bet you it was about two hours, two hour drive, and uh, apparently it was going to be well worth it. Good time, you know, you know what I mean? Good time for the boys and the ladies. So, anyways, we're driving and driving. Check engine light comes on. Boom! Car shuts off. Overheated. Uh oh. So, we're like, oh, we better put that water in if we want to make it there. And uh, so we decided to pour both bottles in and we we're completely out um, driving and driving and we we're like we're not there yet what's going on and check engine light came on again boom mm, shut up calling up the girls car broke down um, do you think you guys can drive the rest of the way to fix it up we apologize we didn't know this was gonna happen so Right away they got in their car because, you know, they wanted us to be there. They had little crushes on us. They wanted us to be at their camp. So, boom, they picked us up. And we were there having a good time. We're not going to really get into, you know, what happened at the camp. But it was a good time. I will tell you that. So, anyways, night's getting pretty, pretty late. And uh, we're trying to find a way to get home because we couldn't stay. Um, the, you know, the, uh, later on the parents ended up arriving. And... You know, we just couldn't say this was way way back like now you know when I was would, you know when parents were still involved and you know their kids uh, staying out late and whatnot whatever anyways so we started walking uh, as we we're trying to call people for maybe a ride you know offer them some cash and whatnot and uh, we weren't getting nothing so we just decided to continue walking we knew it would be far and we we're trying to get a signal we didn't have signals for our phones and batteries were getting low and I was getting worried. So was my buddy Pete, but uh, we were just gonna continue walking until we got a signal. And my buddy said, let's just hitchhike. Um, we couldn't, you know, we weren't getting a signal at the time. But as soon as we got a signal, he already had his thumb out and there was a vehicle coming around the corner. Now this vehicle was like a van-ish, uh, freaky looking van, but it stopped. And as uh, soon as we ended up getting signals for our phones, our phones completely died battery dead nothing so we're pretty much going with this guy now getting into this van was already freaky enough I'd never hitchhiked before and I don't know it was just kind of weird that this the, you know the the phone went dead it was like in a movie where you know all that stuff would happen so it did happen to us phones died we got in the van and it was really really freaky but we told him where we had to go it was almost a two-hour drive with this guy apparently he was from Africa he was driving around the countries and uh, yeah so we ended up running into him as we stuck our thumb out and very very scary guys I don't recommend hitchhiking it is freaky freaky stuff but I mean if you need to do it in an emergency I mean we could have walked but it just probably would have took us a day or two to get back home because it was a far 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 drive but uh, yeah so what I would like you guys to do, if you did enjoy this story, I would like you to drop a like for me. I'd appreciate it so much. It means a lot to me. And as always, if you guys are new to my channel, well, recommend you subscribing. I try and bring the best of the best videos that I can for you guys every single day. If I do miss days, you know, it's because I'm trying to continue to get more and more great gameplays for you guys. And uh, that's pretty much it for story mode. I hope you guys did, like I said, enjoy it. Um, just uh, don't hitchhike 
like I said, unless you have to, it was a very, very uh, scary moment in my life. I would not not do it again. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Peace out, Jay Boons. Goodbye.